I'm Gabe Guy. It's time for more Let's Play Ratchet and Clank. Something about a future and maybe some tools of destruction. I don't know. It's a, it's a video game. We're going to Planet Ardolis, and by going to, I mean we're already here. Right, um, what can we do you for? Nothing. Do you have any new weapons for me met. today? Ah, yes, the Buzz Blades and Nano Swarmers. All right. Um, I don't actually remember this second one at all, but I remember the Buzz Blades. <laughs> um, hmm. You know, I'll go with the Buzz Blades. Everybody loves Buzz Blades. And uh, in the meantime, I think I'll take a little bit of time to upgrade some things. <laughs> Alright, well, um, I'm probably going to speed that up just so you can see me doing it, I guess. Now that that's particularly interesting, but I did stuff. Uh, okay, so here we are at a place. Is there anything behind me? Death. Got it. <laughs> Always got to check, you never know. Uh, so, Buzz Blades. Remember last time how I said I like ricocheting stuff? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> just what I be hungry yeah, the Buzz Blades are like, um... I forget the names of the weapons. There's like weapons in previous games where you basically shoot like little disc blade things. And uh, this one's like those, except it goes really fast and they ricochet like literally everywhere. It's pretty great. Um... Well, I just got really confused for a second. I thought this was the grind rail section. Probably because it is, uh, in disguise. We need helipods. I also got a little confused because the music here is kind of quiet. I, I, I thought it wasn't playing for a moment, but it's there. It's just kind of shy. I don't know. So, grind railing. All right. My favorite kind of place. Um, oh dear. Pterodactyl land. Well, it's not pterodactyl land anymore because it's dead. Uh, there's this big old scary whale thing in the background. That's always a fun time. I love scary whale things. They're my fave. Uh, alright, so... This is pretty much Dynamo in a nutshell, in case you, uh, forgot. These do run out at a point in time, I'm pretty sure. So, uh, gotta be careful of that. Because that's obviously a problem that can happen at points. You know, I mean, I, I think they run out. Either that or some of them, um, probably, I, I just realized I had freaking, like, leech bomb and such I could have used in the last one to make myself live, maybe? Possibly. Hey, guys, you're huddling around the campfire and singing a campfire song? Well, not anymore, because you're dead. There's swing shot targets over there. Um... I'm going to assume they're for later stuff, because I can't quite reach them. That is unfortunate. Uh, it would seem it wants me to do something here. Alright, I can, like, switch uh, the weapon thingies. And by weapon thingies, I mean... Uh, oh, this is going to move, isn't it? Uh, oh, a puzzle, maybe. Oh, those swing shot targets are for now. I don't remember... This game is one of those that lets me go to... Th yeah, alright, it is. For some reason, I thought it was one of those games where you have to actually select the swing shot in order to use it, but apparently it's not. So I was worrying for nothing. Is there anything down there? This looks like Secretville. Population, whatever the heck those things are. I love those guys, but they're dead now, so I don't love them anymore. <laughs> that is just a sad state of affairs. Am I going, like the correct path, or is this the secret path? Because, um... I, I missed, like, an area back there. So, I'm just a little bit confused. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, now that this platform has been lowered, I bet if I let it rise up again... Uh... Does it go back up? Like, do those go away after a while? Yes, they do. Aha! You can't hide from me today, Gold Bolt! I'm gonna eat you! And also point out the fact that uh, in, in the little cutscene, 
Well, before the cutscene, it looked like I fell off, but, uh... Nope! That didn't happen! <laughs> uh, alright, well, I found a secret! Yeah, for me! Um, hello, friends. There's some weirdo things that I don't know what are, but... It's okay! Y'all are dead now! I, can't, I I gotta remember I can do the quick thing with the the, the, the... the double tapping of the triangles. You can also, if you want, I think you can, like, shoot these with the combustor and they... they blow up. I thought so, anyway, but maybe I'm wrong. I could have sworn that the... Maybe I'm thinking of something else? I don't know, but there's a thingy up there that I may want. I don't know what it is, but it may be something I want. Maybe. I don't know. What are you? A uh, you? Did we just find a Wii U? In this game? <laughs> That's awkward. Um, no, it's not. I don't know what it is, though. Um, there's like a ledge over there, I noticed. But I didn't feel like going back to checking it. Oh, hey, we're back here. Well, that's convenient. Uh, Alright, let me refill right. on ammo real quick. And we shall move on now. Onwards to victory! Um... Oh, there's a guy. Hey, guy. Blasters oh, no! Ready, yes, blaster's at the ready. You're dead. <laughs> My blaster was at the ready, too. Oh, the devices guy. I, I forgot about the devices guy for some reason. I thought you were another vendor, but uh, you're just another useless guy. Uh, there's nothing up here you're of interest. Hi. <laughs> how are how are you guys? You, you doing all right? You want shard reapers in your face? You don't. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate for you. Um. Okay. So we got a thingy. Apparently, I have no interest in checking what it is, but uh, you know, I kind of remember this level vaguely, but I don't remember anything about it. Geo laser. Oh, goody. <laughs> the Geolaser's weird. Like, this game is weird about the whole motion controls thing, because it's just, it's like, I don't know. It feels kind of random to me. Uh, I don't know if there's, like, a time limit to this at all. Uh, there could be, but I'm not entirely certain. Um, oops. Yeah, I don't think you want to go out of order. Sardalo Caves? Oh, man. I bet we have to go through here and get over there. Captain I mean, like, what are the odds? <laughs> I know, right? In the vicinity. Bounties up to 20 quid and a new rotator socket. Okay. I, I guess I'm worth a lot. Uh, <laughs> let's just shoot those bats before they get anywhere near me. And then, uh, I, I don't know if they're bats or if there's some weirdo freaky... Not a bat, but something else. Preemptive strike! Alright, I did something! Heck to the yeah! Um, okay, so... Hello, bat friend. You are behind me, and now you're not, because I turned around. Everything is dying. I love this uh, Buzzblade weapon thing that I already kind of forgot the name of, because there's like 10 billion of the same kind of weapon. <laughs> um, oh no, it is Buzzblades. What was I thinking it was? Who knows? I don't know. I know there was one named the Chopper, and that's like the only one I, I remember other than this one. So, uh... Alright, the other one was, I think, Disc Blade Gun? I think. I think. Yeah, you know, I think this Preemptive Strike may be... I, I, I think it may be just something to do with attacking stuff before it's actually there. And since these Disc Blades just kind of go all over the place. I, I think it's safe to assume they probably hit something that I'm not anywhere near. Speaking of, I'm drowning because I can platform good. Hey, we're all the way back here. All right. <laughs> yeah. box. Since when are we playing Jack 2? Gosh. Let's not miss this jump. Might be a good idea. 
Maybe. I don't actually know just yet. Uh, Geolaser again. Alright, my favorite. Um, well, there's boxes down here to get. Oh yeah, that's right, I remember seeing these treasure chests uh, during the cutscene thing. Clearly, I know what I'm doing. Um, oh, we gotta do something with this thing. Maybe I just have to touch all the X's and not necessarily in order. I don't know. Oh, there's, like, muffled singing now. Okay, well, that's entertaining, but I can't hear a word of it, so I'm sure you guys can't either. <laughs> um, anyway, now that that has been said, let's get more weapons. That might be good. Also, because you're going to heal me, that's also good. Good things are, in fact, good, as it turns out. Uh, dude, 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 you're dead. I gotta remember that uh, the Shock Ravager does things unheard of. Geolaser time. Let me guess, I'm gonna break into the party. Hey friends, I'm gonna go join your ballad of singy time. This reminds me of the one minigame in Mario Party, uh, Crazy Cutters, for some reason. Except, uh, it, I can't, like, turn around and just completely ruin it. That box back there was just kind of moving on its own. What I don't know if you noticed. Intruder! Blast that mangy! That guy seemed to have like a slightly delayed reaction. Uh, but alright. Let's go ahead and tornado everyone. Do you guys like tornadoes? I bet you do. I, I bet tornadoes are your fave. Uh, let's go ahead and just kind of run in with plasma beasts. Sounds like a good old-fashioned piratey time to me. Uh, okay, so now that we've done that, Shard Reaper will help us against Shield Men. Shield Men, in this day and age, I don't understand the ways of the world. I really just truly do not. I'm just using a variety of weapons up in here. This seems to be, of course, uh, my fancy. Uh, there's a guy way back at the beginning I somehow missed. Hey there, friend, you're dead. Sure sucks to be you. Oh. Well, uh, hold on, let's do this thing. Because apparently it's really good against shielded guys. I, I don't I don't know if they're like weak to it or what, but it does seem to be doing a decent amount of damage now. What, what is with the, the freaking Shock Ravenger all of a sudden? Like, all of a sudden it's actually good. <laughs> yeah, I've noticed this. For some reason, it just seems to actually be good. I don't know why... Maybe I'm using it correctly. I mean, gosh, why would I do that? There's like tons of boxes down here. Every time there's a room like this, there always seems to be just tons of boxes laying around in the lower level, and then like you have to run around and freaking get them all. Isn't that right, boxes sitting over here in the corner, actually having correct physics for once? You weirdos! <laughs> So there's a bunch of enemies up there, but I can't get up there yet, apparently, so... I don't want to meet Thy Maker. Uh, because he's probably some scientist in a factory or something. Be careful, Ratchet. Oh, hello. The enemy is electrified. We need to keep a safe distance. I never would have noticed, Clank. So, the game didn't really give you a whole lot of time to tell, but that guy was hiding in a treasure chest. Would make sh which kind of makes it this game's version of a mimic, so uh, have fun with that one. <laughs> I don't know. It's always they kind of interesting when there's the mimics in games where there's not usually mimics, you know? I mimics are an interesting type of enemy, I think, just because it's like... It, they prey on the whole, um, you know, greed thing or something. You're close to the treasure room, but you'll need to find a way inside. Slag's crew is already on to us. Right, right. I'm here with uh, another person, apparently. Despite the fact that she and her friends are no longer here. Hey, wait, I just got this to V5! Oh yeah, that's right, I have the help desk off, so uh, we've got no prompt now. It's the Magma Combuster! It shoots three shots instead of just one! That's pretty useful, I have to say. Um... Yeah, as per usual, the uh, first weapon we get is usually the first one to upgrade, so that's uh, absolutely no surprise whatsoever. Uh, let me guess, this is going to take me uh, over there where we might have uh, 
boss fight fun times, maybe? I don't know. I guess we'll have to see next time. So, uh, now that I've upgraded a weapon and I'm not going to show you me using it yet, I guess we'll see it next time. I mean, I used it, just not on an actual enemy, but I, mean, I you could probably figure it out for yourself, maybe. I don't know. Bye!